Hey everyone, good to see you. Thanks for stopping by and checking the channel out, checking this video out. So I figured I would do something I haven't really done a whole lot of. I think I've done two on this channel in the last year, which is a, a review of a product. I think the first one was the Spark 40, and then the next one was uh, the um, the Hard Luck Kings Bombshell Strat style guitar. So this is one I just recently got into my possession. It's the, uh, the Dan Electro Stock 59 model. Uh, as far as why I got it, well, I've got a Strat, I've got a Gibson, I've got a Paul Reed Smith, and a couple of other things. And I think I just kind of wanted this one, if that makes sense. And, and here I am with it now, so it's really cool to, to have. It's, it's very different, very unique. I wouldn't say this is probably the, the guitar most of us go out and get first time around. But if you've got a couple other guitars and you're looking for something different, this very well could be it. So what I wanted to do was just, uh, I'm still getting used to it, I'm still playing around with it, so I figured as I'm doing that, I can kind of go through the amps here with myself and then share with you. I don't really want to make this a review type of uh, video, but more just a chance for you to hear how it sounds through two different amps, no pedals, keep it very simple. I'm going to go through what you just heard, I'll go in through some more detail as far as playing a Fender Blues Junior on a clean channel, just to kind of, again, give it just some... some just to hear how it sounds with the clean channel <clears throat> and again as i mentioned i'm not going to use any pedals but what i'll do is i'll go in through my my pv classic 50 to 12 and i'll use a little bit of overdrive on that just to give you an idea how it sounds fun little guitar to play thus far that i've had it um you know a couple things that stand out very thin you know neck and in, in the nut so i think it's like a 1.62 measurement there so it's pretty interesting i can basically get my my fingers around it almost without touching anything there so uh it has a different feel to it yet i'm still able to, to pretty much play it pretty well so that's cool um the uh the selector switch here i think is pretty unique it's not up and down it's not left and right it's more about 45 degree angle so it kind of you know just kind of flows better when you're you're switching so i think that was pretty cool um and i think that's really it so i don't want to kind of you know give me too much as far as Specs and all that, the, the link is below in the description. You can check that out as far as the specs, where I got it, the whole thing. And I, I leave it up to you, but I figure this would be more of a chance just to play it. You can hear it. Try to keep it as pure as I can without, you know, too much color from, from amp, uh, from uh, pedals and modulation and all that. I might, I'll probably have some reverb on the amps. That's about it, though. Nothing more than that. And uh, that's that's really, uh, that's really it. So I'm going to go through those two uh, amps. And we'll see how it sounds. I have an idea how it's going to sound, but I want to play with it a little bit more. And, uh, you know, let me know if you like this video. I have one or two other guitars I plan on doing that I haven't reviewed as of yet that I've recently uh, gotten. So uh, I'll add those to the channel. But again, if you haven't done so, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Check out the website, sixstringfun.com. I'm going to be adding some, some lessons on there real soon that I've, I've been working on. So, and enough of me talking. I know you want to just kind of hear this thing and hear how it sounds. So let's get right to it. Uh, we're going to go through the two amps and um, hopefully enjoy it. All right. Thanks. Okay. So we're going to go in the Blues Junior right now. I'm going to do as little talking as possible, but just so you know, EQ is pretty much uh, at, at uh, you know 12 o'clock. I've got the volume about a little less than halfway and I have the master on about two, a little bit of reverb as well. So I'm going to kind of just go through the pickups one, two, three, and I'll, I'll you know, kind of put that on the screen as well. Thank you. 
Thanks for sticking around. Really appreciate it. We'll see you soon.